equation, there are multiple ways I could solve it or find the value for x, which makes this true. But in this case, I'm going to use my method of doing reverse order of operations or reversing uh, PEMDAS. Because I'm doing PEMDAS in reverse order, I'm going to save my parentheses until I've done anything that I can without it. So outside the parentheses, there's no addition and subtraction, uh, there's no division, but there is a multiplication. So I'm going to go ahead and undo that multiplication by dividing both sides here by 3. Whatever is in parentheses here, I can just think of that, well, that's going to be some number. I'm doing 3 times some number. And when I divide by 3, I'm just left with that number, whatever is in parentheses itself. So I'm left with simply an x plus 6. No need to write the parentheses now because there's nothing else going on there. On the other side, 24 divided by 3 is 8. At this stage, it should be very obvious what uh, x has to be. But to just formally finish, we're going to subtract 6 on both sides and... In fact, x does equal 2. 8 minus 6 is 2. I'm just going to plug that 2 back into check. And that gives me 3 times 2 plus 6 equals 24. I want to know if that's true. And 2 plus 6 is 8. And yes, 3 times 8 does equal 24. So I know that x equals 2 is, in fact, the correct answer. Thank you.